In this video, we're going to keep looking at examples where we have a two-digit number and a one-digit number, but we're going to focus on situations where we carry. So situations where we're going to get a sum that, that makes us use the basic carrying technique in long addition. So let's try some. 28 plus 5. And then we'll try 37 plus 9. Then we'll try 45 plus 8. And last we'll try 99 plus 9. Okay, so what do we do? Well, 28 and 5, what's 8 plus 5? That's 13. And typically what we do is we write 8 plus 5 as 13 by writing a 3 here, and then we carry the 1 up into the next column. And that's the 1 from the number 13, right? Because 13, what it really is, is 1, 10, and 3, 1s, right? If you think of 13, it's 10 plus 3. It's 1, 10, and 3, 1s. But with long addition, we make sure we line up that 1 from the 13 in the tens column because place value is really important. So 8 and 5 is 13. 3 goes in the 1's place. 1 goes in the tens place. And now we add this 2 and this 1 together. And that equals 3, which really means 30. So the answer here is 33. Then the same idea in the next problem. 9 plus 7 is 16. And we put the 1 up here, we carry it, so that we have 30 plus 10, or 3 plus 1 is 4, or 40, and our answer is 46. In the next one, again, 8 plus 5 is 13. So the 3 from the 13, that represents 3 1s, goes here in the 1s column. And the 10, for convenience sake, and we could put it down here, but we, it becomes very compact by putting it up here, we carry it to the tens place above. And now we have 4 plus 1, or 40 plus 10, which is 50. And our answer is 53. And last, we want to do 99 plus 9. Well, 9 plus 9 is just 18. And we put 1 8 here, and 1 1 up there. And that represents 18. 1 10, and 8 1s. We put the 8 in the 1's column and the 1 in the 10's column. So now we add 9 10's and 1 10. And what does that make? Well, that makes 9 plus 1 is 10, but really that means 10 10's, which is a 1 100. That's why the answer gives us 100 and 8. So really, we, we are still carrying, again, 9 plus 1 is 10 or 90 plus 10, right, which is what we have right here. So 0 and 0, 1 and 9 is 10, but that 10, the extra 1, gets carried to the next spot, equaling 100. And we could put that 1 up here, that puts it in the 100s column, and then we bring it down because there's nothing to add it to. But usually, if we reach the, le the furthest digits to the left and we add them, and we get something above 9, like 10 or 11 or above, we just write the digit right in here, and we're done. And that will lead us into the next video, which is how do you deal with other two-digit combinations in long addition? All right, thanks.